Okay, now we're going to do this. We're going to home format this. Like this, merge. I'm going to make it bigger. This one, I'm going to format. This one has to be like this. Let's say this has to be like this. Okay, that's good. We're gonna we're not going to touch this at all. Okay, I have to make this somehow like this. Okay, I'm gonna increase this. I'm gonna cut this. We're going to add some checkboxes. The uh, ready button. Sorry. We have this first ready button here. We're gonna get from the top value. This is cells to make it shorter. Okay top region so this top region then I copy this this one is cells wrap then we have top top product and then we have top customer okay we have this top customer top product okay here we are that's great align top align distribute horizontally okay now is equal to to this okay okay that's good so if i type okay this you see this is four okay if i tap the second one you have the second one okay yeah we can keep it like this so you can see here what happened so now according to this we get the number okay and this number should be the selection we want to show the top region or the top cells top cells representative or the top product of the top customer so three means that i'm going to select top product so we're going to display here this and this this and this okay top region is cost if i have two top cells representative and this okay so we do like this and to do this, we're going to do the following. Choose this, 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 and this. This is the series of values. And if you follow my previous courses carefully, you know what I'm talking about. So you see now that I'm going to change this. And I'm going to copy this. And I want to paste this here. But this has to be while I'm below okay you see this okay um, home 10 this is also 10 yeah okay we have this okay and now we're going to see what else we can see we show here the top of each area and we're going to see other information important as historical data